This video is about why you should always leave food on your plate when you finish eating. Good morning from Nyharn Beach. It's an amazing morning and as you can understand like when you travel full time the urge or the feeling of wanting to have like a very good looking bikini body feels quite important if, if that is something like if you're into fitness and all of that so you may have heard me speak about this before that when I started out this travel for four months ago I was like I want to get in to my perfect like best ever shape because I care about my body I want to show myself like that I, I do care and I want to give my body the absolutely best that I can give it and I believe like when we are giving our bodies the best you will see that as a physical result as well so I wanted to combine like the inner health with the mind health and like the physical fitness and one extremely important tip and realisa realization that came to me during this time was that I, I have changed my eating habits in the last few years or maybe like the last eight years actually. So before, when I was younger, I used to have this very, very good behavior of leaving food on my plate so uh, I only ate until I was full and I also had this feeling that I wanted to leave some kind of food on my plate to show myself that I was in control that I was the one controlling how much I wanted to eat and it was not the food controlling me and then my ex-mother-in-law she she pointed that out sometimes that she didn't really like that behavior of leaving food on the plate because that was her subconscious programming that leaving food on your plate is not good because you should always finish your food so what did i do what did my subconscious lovely mind come up with in order to fit in i started to eat everything on my food on my plate every time because I wanted to fit in with that tribe and if my behavior was not accepted in that tribe I was going to change it so I could fit in so I could be lovable so I so my behavior and who I am would be enough this is how the mind works it's always going to try to fit in with a tribe if you're not really aware so her programming together with most people's programming is that you have to finish everything on your plate this is what so many children I, sorry for the wind this is like why so many children are told like finish everything it's a lack of food you have to eat everything and this is just it's it's really it's devastating because when you have this behavior you don't listen to your body it might be somebody else even who actually like put food on your plate and they have no idea how much is good for you and even yourself it's very hard to actually know like with your eyes how much you will be able to eat and how much your body needs exactly right now so what I want to encourage you to do is like start to tune in to yourself tune in to your stomach eat slowly feel every bite that you take and really ask yourself am I full am I full because every time you, you eat more than your belly wants, you overeat. And when you overeat, you're going to expand your, your belly. And that starts the craving for more and more food. So you actually, you start to like expand the portions over time. So you will eat more and more. And that overeating is giving you much more calories than your body wants or needs and then you will gain weight or at least like stay the same but it will be, it will be very very hard to to drop weight and that's another thing never say lose weight because the mind doesn't want to lose anything it want to grab on to everything that you are about to lose so just say like i i want to drop weight 
So start to work that out for yourself from today on. Leave something on your food because it's showing yourself like I'm reprogramming that behavior. I know it's fine to leave food on my plate. I'm a grown up person. I can do whatever I want. And it's also going to show your mind that it is enough because one other thing is that in the tribe behavior in some families when we are small there is a lack of food there is a lack of money so you are told like eat everything so you don't waste anything so by showing yourself like i can actually leave food on my plate is showing you that it is an abundance of food so you don't have to like just rush eating because there is always enough and the third thing with that is that you will show your mind that you are in control. You are in control of your eating habits. The food is not controlling you. So many people, so many of my clients, they feel that the food is controlling them. They eat, but they don't want to eat. But they do it anyway. That's because of the, the mind believes that the food is in control of the person. So just by doing this simple little thing, it may seem like such a small thing. And sometimes the small things that somebody tells us it's good for us, we don't do it because they seem like too small and you wanna have this like massive thing that will change everything. But I would say like this is the small but massive thing that will change so much for you. And I would love to hear your comments down below from one or two weeks from now when practice this every single time you eat, every dish, leave something on your food when you feel like, okay, now my belly is full. Trust your body, tune into your body, give your body only what it wants to have. That's for health. And show yourself that you want to take care of your body. You have one body and that body is your tool for live a happy, healthy life. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel because here on this channel, you will get updates on how to live a happy, healthy life by, by being the best you when starting to reprogram your subconscious mind to work in your favor. And when your subconscious mind is working in your favor, you will see the whole law of attraction is working in your favor. So I wish you a beautiful, amazing day. And remember that you yourself is the only person that creates your beautiful, magical day. That's all love. Bye.